10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Vehicles get back. Stage one propulsion is nominal. Vehicle is supersonic. Well, after a brief hiatus, Electron is back in the skies, heading to orbit. At T plus 35 seconds into flight, we're coming up to one of the first milestones of any mission to space, passing max Q. This is the point at which Electron will experience the highest amount of aerodynamic force on its way to orbit. Let's listen into the call from Mission Control. Maximum dynamic pressure. Pass through max Q. Stage one propulsion is holding nominal. Stand by. And there you have it. Electron has cleared seconds. max Q. Entering burnout to tech mode. AOS Chatham Station. Coming up next is main engine cutoff, or MECO, which occurs when the nine Rutherford engines shut down after exhausting their fuel reserves. Upon shutdown, the empty stage is jettisoned so that stage two can, ign can ignite and continue on its journey to low Earth orbit. 30 seconds remaining. Altitude is 50 kilometers, speed is 1.6 kilometers per second. Miko confirmed. Stage two ignition confirmed. That's the call we're looking for. We've had successful MECO, clean separation of Electron's first stage, and ignition of the vacuum-optimized Rutherford engine on Electron's second stage. We're approaching T plus three minutes into this mission with fairing separation coming fairing up next. Fairing separation complete. And there it is on your screen. The fairing has separated, clearing the way for payload deployment, which occurs approximately one hour Station after liftoff. Station is nominal. For the next few minutes, you'll be hearing the word nominal quite a bit. The latest call was from Kevin Garcia, our Stage 2 operator. And it's one of our favorite words at Rocket Lab, and it simply means everything is going as expected throughout the flight. On your left, you'll see a view of the operators in the mission control room. These are the people you've been listening to throughout the broadcast on the mission control net, and they're monitoring all things launch related from propulsion and telemetry data all the way through to our network traffic. We've heard plenty of updates from George Buchanan, our GNC operator today. The Rocket Lab GNC team are actively recruiting for senior roles in our photon satellite program. So if you have a solid background in mathematics or physics, head to our career section at rocketlabusa.com for more info. 250 seconds remaining. Stage 
these two proportion remains nominal. Up next is the battery hot swap. This step is unique to Electron and its battery powered pumps housed within the Rutherford engines. The pair of batteries that carried us thus far are nearing depletion, so to finish the job, we swap power over to a third fully charged battery. Let's wait for confirmation from Mission Control. HVB battery discharge nominal, approach your hot spot. Struggling down. Hot spot, just because I fell. Battery jettison confirmed. As you've just heard, we've had successful battery hot swap. Electro Electron's trajectory continues to look nominal as we hit six minutes and 50 seconds into this mission. Stage two propulsion holding nominal. If you're just joining us, we've had successful liftoff of Rocket Lab's Don't Stop Me Now mission aboard our Electron launch vehicle. We are nearing second engine cutoff with kick stage separation scheduled in about a minute and a half. While on this mission, the kick stage is being used in its most basic form to deploy our customer payloads to orbit. However, the kick stage can be adapted to become a satellite in its own right. With the addition of elements like higher performance propulsion, radiation tolerant components, and solar panels, the kick stage becomes Photon, Rocket Lab's in-house designed, built, and operated satellite. Keep an eye out for our first photon GD mission coming soon. The next major milestone you'll hear is SECO, or second engine cutoff. This marks the end of the second stage burn, after, with, after which the kick stage will separate in preparation for payload deployment. 40 seconds remaining. Intent burn out to tech mode. Guidance is in terminal. Seconds remaining. Seco confirmed. State situation confirmed. And we're going to get transferred.